is a public communication since services collect call from... Oh, Steve. An inmate at the Calumet County Jail. The use of three-way or a call waiting will disconnect the call. This call will be monitored and recorded. To accept this call, dial 5 now. Hello? Oh. Hello? Can you hang on a second? Yeah. I gotta shut something off. Okay. Hi, sorry. <laughs> I just got off the phone with Carla. You actually called at a good time. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah, I just hung up the phone. I'm like, what the hell does she want again? <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I missed your full call earlier. I think you called it a little after four. Yeah. Yeah, I missed that one. Oh. I wasn't in the house, and by the time I got in there, the phone stopped ringing. Oh. Yeah. Well, I figured you were out doing something. No, I just got home from, uh... Work? Uh, no, I was... I went over and stopped over and fired up. Oh. And then I went to the bank, and then when I got home, I got in the house and I heard it go click. I was like, uh-oh, somebody <laughs> called. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I figured, well, it may probably out doing something, or I don't know how much snow we got or what, or... No, nah, hardly anything. Mm -hmm. Oh. Just enough to make it sloppy again. Yeah. Oh. That's about it. Oh. Yeah, I was just working on uh, putting in my stove pipes. Oh. Oh. Where? For the wood stove down in the basement. Oh. Oh, I didn't even see that. No? No. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I got to do something. I ain't freaking going to keep showing out that big money for that propane. Oh, yeah. And that's what they're getting for that shit. Yeah. Yeah, that it is. So what's new with you? Oh, uh, uh, when you go up north? Probably tomorrow morning. <laughs> I know that. Yeah. Uh, tell Ma, uh, and Carla, and, uh, and whatever. And we've got to start making out something for some money. You mean? A uh, fun. You know, for for bail and uh, for getting an attorney. Oh. Because I just got something in the mail. A guy wants to donate uh, almost 25 grand. Really? One person. That's what he's got in the bank. Oh. Now. Now. He got, I think, maybe another less than 400 bucks. He'd have 25 grand in it. Oh. Now. So. That's a good thing. So I think if you start something up, it'll be better. Yeah. You know. And then I got to, uh, let's see. I don't even know how, how would you, how would a guy go about doing that? You'd have to go on the internet, huh? I don't imagine. I don't even know. Newspapers or. Something. Or, or something. I don't know how to fucking thing. Uh, and then I got an appointment tomorrow with a, uh, with a uh, assorted press. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Tomorrow on Thanksgiving? Yeah. I, told, uh, I should be in the office all day, so 12 uh -oh. o'clock I got to I gotta call, call her. Yeah. That's going to odd on Thanksgiving. Yeah. Well, I suppose somebody's got to work. <laughs> sure glad it ain't me. <laughs> so I said, I... Tell her I'll call her at 12 o'clock tomorrow. Yeah. And hopefully, you know, that must be a new, big newspaper. Well, I have no clue. Yeah. I guess it's from all around the world. Well? Yeah. How so, come I've never heard of it then? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so I figured maybe she could put an ad in there for me for money. Oh? To hire me a lawyer and get bail. All right. You know, if it comes all the way around, you know. A lot of people kind of know I'm innocent, you know. Yeah. And, well, I'm starting to get ten letters a day. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Holy crap. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I got ten, eleven of them today. Wow. Yeah. Uh, some girl wants to come up to see me and everything else, and 
<laughs> That's weird. Yeah. Yeah, so, I don't know. So that's it for now. I figured that'd be a good start. You know, almost 25 grand. Yeah. I know. Plus, he sent me some other stuff. He sent me... Let's see, where is it? Oh, uh, not that one. I should have had this out, but I didn't know if you were going to answer or not. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that is what he's got in the bank. $24,627.95. Wow. That's what he's got in there. And he's from Stevens Point. Huh. Yeah. Well, that's a good, good chunk. He's going to give it to me. Oh, one right here. He's got a reward. $10,000. Will be paid for any information leading to our arrest and a conviction of persons who seen Teresa Hudbeck. A $10,000 reward. This call was from the Calumet County Jail. This call may be monitored or recorded. For any law enforcement or justice uh, cleaning up the slain of Teresa Harbeck, rewarding a sum of fifty thousand dollars. That's a that's a poster. You still there? Yeah, I'm oh. still here. Oh. I'm just I was listening to you. <laughs> <laughs> that's from the same guy. Oh well. Yeah. Who's got that money? I got three, three letters from him the last couple of days. I just, got, oh. I just got that money from him today. Mail. Well, I'll mention it to Carla and, and your mom once. Mail. Yeah. I figure between everybody, you know, guys should be able to uh, do something with it. Then that woman from, uh, or comes out, he's got a, they got a meeting Friday at 3 o'clock. You know, Ma, Barbara, whatever. <clears throat> oh, they're coming out by your Ma's house or what? Yeah. Oh. The mother people are, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I, get, I guess she got some information. So I don't know. I can't say too much over the phone. Yeah. You know, so they know. But you know, maybe everything will, will work out like it's supposed to, huh? Let's hope so. <laughs> Me too. I know. Yeah, I figured I'd tell you that so you can tell Ma that and everybody. Okay. Did you talk to her today or no? Oh, Ma? Yeah. No. Oh. No. She don't have a cell phone on her? Well, I can't call a cell phone. You can't? No. No. Oh, oh wow. Well, I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, she got my cell phone. We'll call your own damn phone then. <laughs> yeah, I wish I could. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Last time I talked to her last night. Yeah. And Jody. Did you get through to your mom? Yeah. On her phone? Yeah. Well, Carla had said something to me about that they had a block on there or something. Yeah, from here. From this phone company. Oh, really? Yeah. 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 Well, guys, we stayed spend an hour on it and everything else and a lot of times. Yeah. You know, you know. I suppose it's long distance and everything, so I don't want to spend too long on it. Yeah. I don't think it's long Huh? I don't I don't think that's long distance from here. Because we have a Sherwood phone company. Yeah. And if I am mistaken I think Chilton is part of I don't know. I don't know. I don't know either. Oh. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise, I got my little canteen today when I ordered, so. Canteen? Yeah. Commissary. Oh, yeah? Yeah. So now I got some letters and, you know, some paper and some envelopes, stamps, so I can write. Oh. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think, uh,. Carla took down what that you can what you can have like T-shirts and socks and 
and that stuff. But I think she was either she or or your mom were going to look into bringing you some. No, I got some. Do you? Yeah, I bought some. Oh. No, no, I bought underwear and socks. Yeah, I think she, your mom or Carla were talking about bringing you some. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. <clears throat> well, otherwise, I got new stuff in the. Or one of the vehicles. Or it's at your house. No, it might be in the front bed. Uh, I think it might be in the, it might be in the flat bed because I don't, I don't think we have any. The only thing we have is your 12 pack of soda sitting on, on the cupboard yet. Oh, well, <laughs> we'll drink it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's yours. Yeah, that's the only thing that I know of that, that's yours. Yeah, there is a pair of socks, but I don't know if they're yours or if they're Chuck's. No, it must be maybe Chuck's then. I don't know. I think my insurance is in the flat bed. I think I put it back in there. Yeah, because Kyla asked me, she goes, are these your socks? I'm like, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, mine were a broad brand, no. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah, I suppose. I don't want to be too long. Really? Well, it's good to hear your voice today again. Yeah, I'm yours too. <laughs> yeah, I would imagine so. Yeah. Yeah, I talked to Barbara way before. Did you? Yeah. You mean she was home? Yeah. She's sick. Oh. Yeah. Probably from sitting out in that fucking crappy weather. Yeah. I'm going to pick it up from Scotty. Scotty's sick too. Got a cold oh. or whatever. And, you know, next time you talk to her, you'll have to tell her she's got to keep quit tongue, tongue in him or something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, as long as you know that, so you can tell them. Yeah, and then also let Carla know when she comes home tonight and yeah. and she can bring it up with, with yeah. Grandma. Yeah. Well, happy Thanksgiving. Yeah, you too. I wish it was happier. I know, me too. <laughs> <laughs> And I mean, to uh, happy Thanksgiving without you, uh, it's going to be even weirder when we go up to, up north next, or tomorrow, I mean, and uh, you're not there. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to suck. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, if you want a place to stay, you can stay in the camper or not, else. I don't know if, if she wants to stay up there overnight or not. Oh. i got to make firewood on Friday, so if we do stay up, we have to get our butts back home quick. Yeah. Yeah. Got to make the firewood while I got off. You know, otherwise you have to turn on the heat, plug the thing in, and <laughs> turn on the heat in the middle, where the air conditioning is. Yeah. Yeah. It says heat. What is it, plug in? Yeah, oh, it plugs into the, uh, I got it plugged into the, uh, 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 the thing there. Oh. All you have to do is open up. This call is from the Calumet County Jail. This call may be monitored or recorded. Yeah, the cellar. All you have to open up the door and plug it in. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'll mention it to Carla, see what she wants to do. Yeah. It all depends on how late we stay up there. Yeah. Otherwise, you got Chucky's room too up there. Yeah. Yeah, I suppose they're not now. Sure. Yeah. That no. sucks then you're going to be able to call anybody tomorrow. No. That's a bummer. <laughs> yeah, well, I'll handle it. <laughs> <laughs> Well, actually, you can call Barbara tomorrow. Yeah. I think she'll be, she's supposed to be home. She wasn't going anywhere. No, I think she had to go to somebody's house for Thanksgiving. Oh, did she? Yeah. Oh, because she didn't say nothing to me and Carla about it. Yeah, I think so. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, nothing else. I'll talk to you later then. Alrighty, nothing else. Give us a jingle on Friday. Yeah. We should be home later on in the afternoon if nothing else. Yeah. Okay, then. Have a good one, then. You too. All right, then. We'll see you. Okay, then. Bye. Bye. Bye.